What it do, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Hellcat Slick, and I'm back here for another banger video. The best video that you ever see in your life. Look at this pretty view right behind me, man. All this can be for you if you just gonna subscribe to the channel. <laughs> but nah, for real though, man. How y'all doing out there, man? Like I said, it's your boy, Hellcat Slick. If this is your first time checking out my channel, please do your boy a big solid, man, and go on and hit that like button. Go on and hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment down there and say, what's happening? Like, you know, I got my New Orleans shirt on. Got my New Orleans hat on, you know? Like I said, what's happening? Not what's up, but what's happening? What's the season? Yeah, man. Oh, for real on the deal. The Holy Spill. I'm finna show y'all the new whip. Got here right here behind me. Still ain't came up with a name for it yet. But I want y'all to see this thing, man. If y'all been here very first time checking out my car, I'm finna give y'all a walk around, a tour of it. And also, if you're new to the channel, man, Go and check out my last three videos on how my Hellcat got stolen. See what that thing looks like before you even see it in this. So now you can see the before and the active. And then you can see the difference between the 2017 Hellcat and the 2020 Hellcat. You know what I mean? So I'm going to flip this camera and I'm going to show you the difference. All right. So let's go on and get it started real quick. Off the rip, you know, 2020 wide body Hellcat already. Got 305s in the front, three, actually 305s all the way around. Got my, see, look at that dip in there, boy. Look at this, the wheel go way in there, for real, for real. A little dirty right now, so we're gonna get that clean. We riding on um, Pirelli's right now, so you know how that thing is. And look at that wheel gap in there. So I might, I seen a few little videos talking about little 315s all the way around. Eh, that might cover up my wheel gap just a little bit more. Instead of lowering it, I like that, for real. You know, the 2020s that come with this badge right here. I'm solid white. I got the black package on the top. Like I said, Pirelli's all the way around, man. So I'm just giving y'all a full scoop of what it looks like. Um, for real. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Got a D-badge in the back. I already got my Dodge off in the back as well, man. Got the um, tips on there. The car's a little quiet to me. I think I need to fire that thing up and make it loud and more a little aggressive real quick so let me fire it up so i can get the outside then we gonna go into the inside this is what five inch stock sound like yeah very disappointing for a hillcat i can tell you that yes indeed um don't pop the hood, you know, from, that's part of the outside show as well, man. But that wide body kit looks so nice on the man. Let me step back and show y'all a good thing. Y'all might think I'm playing. Yeah, y'all might be think I'm playing with y'all. Look at that. Had to zoom it out a little bit. Y'all think it's a game? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all see what's going on right here. We in and out that thing, boy. Yes, indeed. Let me go and pop this hood. Boom. So, Hellcat for real, for real. Y'all see what's going on. Tighten that thing up. Y'all see what's Hellcat for real. See y'all see what's going on, man. So right now, yeah, like I told y'all in my last video, y'all don't even see my pop my hood when it's stock. So right now, you know, just got it stock, whatever. Yeah, but it's gonna be this might be this will be the last time y'all see this thing like this. So don't get it misconstrued when you like, oh we can look underneath that hood. Yeah, this will be the last time, sweetie. <laughs> this is it, but if yeah, you see Hellcat, make sure it's for real for real. Ain't no ain't no which one comes on there. What the world gotta be on there? I guess he was trying to ride and rest, man, but for you new people who didn't know, code intake right here, your cooling goes right here. This is what reads the call for your thermostat and different stuff like that. Tell you how much air coming through. Yeah, um... Dang, bro, I changed this on my last one. I forgot what it's freaking called. Man, y'all dropped down in the comments. I know what it's called, but I can't think of it right now on the spot. Dang. Anyway, thermostat sitting right there. You got your pullers, what most people be changing. Um... See the supercharger on the thing, you already know. Fuse box. This is what your ABS module at, man. So make sure y'all tap into the old video, another Hellcat, and y'all see the problems I ran with with that thing right there. And give y'all a little glimpse what that hood looks like. 
pop on that thing. Oh, yes, indeed. Oh, you see it. So, that's it for the outside. Got the black hood, Hellcat. You know, you know. Really like it on the front. I mean, I don't got nothing against it. You know, I was gonna do the wide body kit. I ain't got nothing against it. I was gonna do the wide body kit on my car anyway, as y'all already know. So, I was out there, I said, why not try to see if we can ease on in why about it because i ain't want to pay for another hellcat and then back door throw another four thousand dollars on it just for this well grill the grill from the red side skirts the back and yada 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 so we did that man so we're gonna step into the cabin and i'm gonna show y'all the difference what i got going on real quick all right so you know i got that black on black on black with the red seat belt so it's still real <laughs> yes Yes, indeed. Uh, this is what it looks like right here. Oh, man, I think it looks clear. This is what it looks like right here. Got my sunroof, as y'all know. Got a sunroof, all black. Got the suede on the top. All the way around. Notice a true Hellcat when you see that right there. Um, Fire the thing on that one time for y'all. Time for the one time, so. Um, difference, dashes, everything like that is the same how it was last time, you know, all this is pretty much the same. This is really what's the big difference right here. When that thing loads up. So I didn't know that it really do all this. So check this joint out, bro. Peep this. We got Wi-Fi in here. <laughs> Let me see. If I can click on the thing. Yeah, so you got Wi-Fi. So you can connect to your personal hotspot to the car. Actually, scratch that. The car has its own personal Wi-Fi, bro, which is crazy. Didn't even know that right there about it. The travel stuff right here. Like, I was riding around, and this car told me yesterday that we was under a thunderstorm watch or whatever, right? So I was like, dang. Most definitely. That's dope. It just popped up out of nowhere saying what we had going on. And you can change it. Yeah, you can change all that stuff. Then they got movie listings, so it'll pop up with the movies that's near you. They got sports. You know, you can select different stuff like that. So let's go NBA basketball, since y'all think I'm... Um, let's see, scores and schedules. Uh, I guess today, you know, somebody always playing today. And you just click it, and it gives you, like, the listing of it and everything that they add to your favorite team, different stuff. Um... Dang, movie listens, your favorite. Uh, I guess this is like your traffic and different stuff like that. I never clicked on it. Traffic events, traffic overview, reroutes and different stuff like that. Yeah, see the old Hellcat, the 2017 Hellcat didn't have what they had. Heated seats, all that different stuff like that. So this assistant. So, what the assistance is for? I forgot. These pages be loading real slow. I'll tell you that much. Gonna open that thing up a little bit. It's a little hot sitting in this car. Okay, I ain't got no subscription for that. Oh, she told me to get in the car, so I'm gonna do that later on. Uh, what is this? Is active service? Pretty much just like the most of the boring stuff. I'm pretty sure y'all really don't care about this, but bro, I didn't know this car do all this, bro. Had all this. What is this? Yeah, we're going to get into that later. Uh, projection. So, you can... So, whatever is showing on your phone, you can show that joint on this screen, bro. Like, no cap. That crap is crazy. So, you can project whatever's on your phone to here. They got your SOS call. I went over the Wi-Fi mod. Um, your, now, this is what I feel like was very handy, bro. They got a user guide for the vehicle. Instead of looking through your... um. What's that joint called? Your manual, bro. You just click on what you need. Engine components underneath the hood. Um, just something like this. And that thing brings you to it, fam. Like, it brings you exactly what you need, bro. That is amazing. And if you don't know what you're looking for, you know you just hit search and different stuff like that. But the home page. You can search that thing up right here. Instead of digging through them papers over there, bro, you could do all that from right here. Um, sending goes. So sending goes like you can order pizza before you even get there. I got to call that that subscription. 
Let me see anything important back there. No. Nah. So this was the main thing that y'all watch this video for. Y'all need to know about this right here. The performance pages. And it actually loads up a lot faster than the um the other Hellcat, I would say. So check this out. So now you can customize what you want up here. So like I'm finna add a gauge. I don't even know which one was up there. I already had horsepower. Uh, I guess cooling temperature would be my next one. Yeah, so. Yes, indeed. My G Force. Can I edit that? Oh, yeah, we definitely give a G Force. Current speed, current gear, intake temperature, the torque. Um, What do I mostly use it for? So then you know you got your timers or whatever right here. So yeah, a little something light. <laughs> a little something light, bro. 13 miles, 19 miles. So I really ain't had time to play with it. Yeah, I ain't really had time to play with it. So you know you got your gauges. Now on the other one, they had gauge one and two. Now this one, they got it up here where you gotta click it like this. So you know you can you can move it around or whatever, however you want. And then you can hit picture right here. And what it'll do, it'll, it'll send it to your phone. G-Force, pretty much how you hitting the curve and different stuff like that. It's really kind of boring, but it is what it is. You know what this is right here. Yeah, that's your gauge. And this is what I really love about it right here, bro. So anything, you can see exactly what you got going on. If you know what you're looking at, gears on, gears off. Yeah, you can do all that stuff just like that, bro. Um, Let's go back. Um, next one, SOT. Oh, just here. All right, so then boom. This is another mod that didn't come with it right here. So now you got your cooling in. So you at the racetrack, you running different stuff like that, bro. You can put it in cool mode. Like right now, all conditions must be meant before racing cool down future. Yada, yada, yada. What the details is it? All conditions must be met before future. So, you, so your car really gotta just be up there. I gotta pop my hood. I gotta turn my engine off and dip myself there. I ain't finna turn my engine off because I'm hot. So just know that comes with it. Oh, let me get back to it. I want done reviewing this part. So also we got active line. <laughs> you feel me? Active. Yeah, it's doing active, so we gonna we ain't gonna do it right now. <laughs> you got your shift light. Oh man, you got uh, control launch. Yeah. Yeah, cancel that. Cancel, cancel. Oh, we're not finna run right now. Well, this thing will run me into the damn with to the wall. I don't know how to cancel it. I'm gonna turn my vehicle off. <laughs> I was scared because I would have hit the gas and I would have went dead into that wall up there. Yes, indeed. Oh, boy, I would have ran dead into that wall. So, next thing. Actually, that's not how I want to. I want to go into it like this. So, you know, you click on your driver mode to get to where you want to go. So then you can have your setup and different stuff. I got, I think I got my setup correctly. Yes, indeed, because I only have one key, baby. Steering. My steering's in. Did I read that right? Why is my steering in sport? Bro, I know y'all reading this correctly, right? Y'all saw me, okay, bad. Bet, bet. Okay, so yeah, now you got it like that. You know, you got your sport mode, you got your track mode, you know, you got different stuff like that. So, it's kind of how I ride right there. You got your valet, your race options, pretty much your line lock, lock control, all of that. So, you can set this however you want it. I think I have mine it's on 15. Yeah, right there. Yep, race, this, that, cool down, different stuff like that. Yeah, man. So that is pretty much what the what the new whip look like. I mean, pretty much the same thing. Only thing different. Check this out right here. So we got that new thing right there. So huh. yes, indeed. You know, I got my sunroof. So I'm I'm gonna be real active now. Nah, Y'all check that thing out, boy. You boy Hellcat Slick came a long way. Now I got a sunroof. And watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Whoo! That lightning. Hit that AC. Oh yes, 
indeed, man. But y'all peep it, man. Like I said, I got my black seats, got my red seat goes really much steering wheel. So I'm gonna tell you what this thing sounds like. Stock. See if it's here. Ah. Ah. Kind of loud but it's not really loud you know what i'm saying so it's up there but it's not up there and we gonna get it up there man so let me go and get back outside turn the car off and different things like that and show y'all i didn't show y'all the wide body hope y'all like what y'all see man i'm really excited about this build that's coming up not excited that i really got to start over you know but i mean it's Things happen for a reason. What was and this is what I want to take. I want to talk about while I'm out here. Y'all know my Hellcat got stolen, but like, how? What was the reason? What prevented my hell? I don't know what God had in plan for me or where I was gonna wind up in that car. Something might bad would have happened. And he probably he said, "Let me go on and take this from you." Or I wind up at this car me at the wrong scene, wrong time, or whatever, and something worse could happen. I couldn't. I could. Something probably could have happened to me. I wanted to be standing here making this video for you guys, bro. You got. That's why I like to look at it like that. Something bigger happened for me not to be in that car at that time for my car to get stolen. I mean, it's the bad way to look at it, man. But I mean, something, something came. Look what came after that, bro. Two weeks later. Back, yeah, two weeks later, man. Yeah, man. So make sure y'all stay on y'all grind, man. And whoever y'all worship, make sure y'all keep worshiping who y'all worship, man. Keep the man upstairs above and y'all prayers. And just believe in him, bro. And anything can happen, bro. Lost my Hellcat. And two weeks later, I done came back with another one, man. That's all. Just blessed. That's all I'm going to say, man. And make sure y'all oh, see that Nola game, baby. Not Nova, but Nola. You heard me? Yeah, man. So it's your boy Hellcat Slick, man. I'm gonna tap out of here and bought y'all another banger video, man. And showed y'all the y'all drop down and give me a name for the car, bro, man. Cause you know last time was ghost, you know, ghost never died. So I don't know, man. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking, bro. So man, I'm going in this video right here, man. I appreciate every single one of y'all that be watching my videos, man. Subscribe to the channel, y'all liking this video, y'all supporting the move, y'all supporting the grind, man. You know, this YouTube stuff ain't easy, man. You gotta work a full-time job, and you come over here and do this and try to put another about 20 hours into it, man, throughout the week. It's a real struggle out here, man. But make sure y'all watching all my bros' channel, watching them ads, letting the ads just sit at the bottom. Like, you ad, come on, man. Just go and go to the store, come back. Wind the clip back, the ad ain't gonna pop up again, and you just rewatch the video again. You know what I'm saying, man? So let us go on and get our little sense out of that little ad that YouTube be really messing us over on, man. But <laughs> that's gonna be it for real. Oh, y'all hear that? Little Mustang getting through that. He lucky. <laughs> he lucky. I'm here. I'm right here. Cause I go get him. Uh, go for real, man. I appreciate every single one of y'all watching my videos, man. Boy, Hellcat slicking him out of here.